this is an average city golf cluster and this is an average city golf and i want to change the whole dashboard to look like a velocity because it's one of my dream cars <laughs> When I first bought the car, the first thing that I did is the exterior. I wanted to make sure that the car is rust free and I also painted the whole car. So the exterior with the fresh new paint looks mint. That's the exterior done. And previously I took myself out of my comfort zone by rebuilding an engine for the first time. With the engine fully rebuilt, I can now enjoy driving the car. Since the exterior looks mint and the engine is running smooth, only thing that is left is the interior. So it would have been impossible for me to enjoy the car with this cluster because it is broken. So I had to purchase a new one, but I wanted to upgrade. And I remember that I love a Velocity cluster or dashboard. So that's what we got. On the previous video, we had new mods for the engine and the new parts for the engine, which led to me cleaning the engine before fitting them. And we also upgraded the door. It's a small modification, but it came out really good. Now, let's go to the interior. So, I want to fit this cluster. Since I bought this cluster, I have never tried to fit it and test if it is working or not. The person who sold it to me, he said he's not sure that it is working or not, but I'm hoping that it does work. If it doesn't work, then I'll transfer everything from here to the other cluster. My cluster, the only thing that is not working is the rev count. The only thing that is not working is the rev count but everything else works and even the speedometer somebody told me that uh, there is a level sensor that is not working on this and i'm not actually sure if it is um for the rev count tell me what could be wrong with the rev count what makes the rev count to work but now i want to fit the cluster so let's do it so usually there'll be a bolt right there and another one over there and you will have to remove the cover that is supposed to cover this and i think the cluster will come out now I'm going to remove the lower part of the dish, which will allow me to have access to the plugs behind the cluster. All I have to do is unplug them and the whole cluster is out. Well, it took me about, I think, 15 minutes to get this out. But now it is out. It's just this plug and this plug at the back and here they are. So that is like a modified version of this one from the back i think they're the same i don't think they're different there's there's a difference between them i think they're just the same you can see from the back you cannot tell the difference let's just hope that uh, this one will work I wanna be the best in the game, invest in my name Check no restraints, I'm obsessed with the pain I ingest, I retain, assess and I change Possessed by the thought I'll be free one day From society's restraints, money, clout and fame Mud disease, a plague, we all love to hate Have to play the game, have to make a name All our insecurities are on This display. is war with the enemy Think that it was meant to be Living in a town We, we finally got the cluster in But we are having pennies Cause the cluster is not showing any clocks right now i don't know maybe i should put the key in so that it can show but this is a bad sign of it not working or it needing a control box that is related to it i don't know let me try to get the key and see if it will make any difference yeah here are the key let's see if there will be any difference nothing but let's see if the car will start yeah the car starts but the cluster is not showing anything or saying anything which means the cluster might not be working so maybe we'll need to swap everything from there to this one disassembling the cluster is pretty much easy because there's just some tabs at the back it's going to undo those clips and then the whole cluster will be disassembled then we can transfer everything to the other cluster That was the easy part now the difficult part is to know how to remove this plastic cover and transfer it to this one this looks more modified or more upgraded than this one because this is just blank let me try to remove this and see if it will actually be removed i think these things can be <sighs> not sure but let me try to remove them much 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 later update of what's actually happening the way to transfer to remove this cover it is pretty much easy you just have to unclip this but it's really hard make sure that you do, you do not break them i managed not to break any of them now i'm going to unclick the other ones from my trust then we can transfer the whole face to my trust <clears throat> ice in my veins i've been driving this train 
few minutes later we finally got the cluster in and this is not the cluster that was previously in i i swapped everything to this cluster i took everything from this cluster and put it on this cluster but still things didn't work so i took everything back and i put it back where they they were before so this is the new cluster that i put in and it has done uh 184,791 kilometers and this one i cannot remember what kilos but i know it's one something i'm going to check what kilos they were here if i find that the kilos that were here are still are lower than this then i'm going to go back and transfer everything here to there but i'm glad that i did not buy a cluster that does not work the cluster is is working 100 percent. the only thing i think i need to do is buy a control box and i gotta say this is a good modification it's a good thing that we bought that cluster because look at it even from the back that's a good looking cluster right there now what i want to do is remove this piece and remove this one and remove that and we're going to paint it silver so that it, it kind of matches with that i know it won't be 100 percent matching with it but I'm going to be removing the vent with a screwdriver and being careful that i do not scratch them <clears throat> ice in my veins i've been driving this train years in this lane there's no stopping this flame because i came to the game and i changed it to play how i like rearranged it to my own domain yeah i got what it takes made lots of mistakes taking shots skipping breaks feeling lost feeling great popping off singing straight never stop never changed all the squad here to play and i've got something to say yeah i work hard each and every day i get lost in the words i say i don't push pause no i push play I won't stop till I make a change I withdraw on the things I make I turn flaws into flawless traits I build tall, never cap in space I won't stop till I hear him say So now I'm going to prepare them for paint and then we're going to paint them and see how they will come out. Hopefully they will come out better than the way I think they might come out. So let's just, let me prepare it and I'll get back to you. was able to strip it apart so i'm going to clean this and i'm going to try to do this to make it look like a steering wheel because it doesn't actually look good but for now the focus is on this i didn't know it's a metal piece i thought maybe it's plastic but it seems like it's a metal piece or something like that so i'm just gonna prepare it for paint and i'm going to paint it
so we got the metal part cleaned and prepared we got it prepared and cleaned and now i'm going to paint it i'm going to wait wait for it to dry then i'm going to paint it i did not know that this is a metal piece but hopefully i'll be i'll be able to return it to its old way the way it's supposed to look and with this i think they came out good except for this one that i'm holding in my hand because i don't know it just didn't come out correct but overall it won't be that much visible and with the steering wheel <clears throat> it is kind of worn it need it will need to be fabricated a little bit and i think it won't be a challenge and i might do it myself so i'm going to try to fabricate the steering wheel and make it look as better than the way it is for now because if you can look at it it is worn because it is old and another thing to note that we don't have a bell but that is not an issue i can fabricate something to make a bell if i'm not able to make it i'll just have to buy another one but i don't think it would be complicated for me to fabricate another bell so let me just wait for that to dry and we'll get back right to back to the video where we're going to paint that so Everything is in except for the steering wheel and I have to tell you that the interior is looking like a dream now. Even though I did an overspray on some parts such as here, there's an overspray here and an overspray over here and as well as this one, but that's not an issue with thinners, I can actually remove those um, oversprays. Plus we got the piece for the steering wheel also dry and it looks better than the vents that I painted. I don't know if we call it the vents or what, but it looks better than them. Yeah, so now I'm going to fit it on the steering wheel. Here's the steering wheel and it looks worn a lot so what i'm planning is to take a a vinyl and try to cover the steering wheel just to make the steering wheel look brand new and i want to paint the steering wheel black because if you can check here it has a uh, sort of like rust or something so i'm going to paint this black and i'm not going to do it on this video i'm going to do it on the next video and i'm sorry for making the video so short i was busy with other things but this week there's going to be another video on friday or sat on friday or saturday there's going to be a new video um then next week is i'm going to try to be consistent with the videos so next week uh there's going to be videos and videos and videos after videos i'm going to try to make the videos really entertaining as much as possible as much as i can so tell me what you like about the video tell me what you hate about the video and what do you think i should do on the golf work one after doing the interior and i guess i'll see you on the next one because the next thing on this call is just modification if you haven't liked make sure that you like if you haven't subscribed make sure that you subscribe and follow me on instagram so that when the time comes for us to do giveaways i'll be able to communicate with you guys on instagram follow me on instagram the link is in the description and i'll see you guys on the next one peace